All right, now to that breaking news out of Cranston this morning, where on this Good Friday, parents have just learned whether their children have to go to school today. Now, when this news reporter Jared Pliner joins us live now with the late breaking details. Jared. Danielle, good morning. Well, after the last several hits of saying we were still waiting and things were still up in the air, we now know the gross majority of Cranston students will be in school today. Affirmative, yes. The one exception, Western Hills Middle School. Just got off the phone with Superintendent Judy Lenson. She says that was the one area where her staffing was inadequate and where they had to call things off today. But by and large, sorry, kids, you will be on, at school on this Good Friday. But again, uh, there are a good number of families who may very well keep their kids out for religious reasons and I, of course are more than free to do that. Tally still in flux uh, according to Dr. Lunston about how many teachers called out in the end. She said they were allowed to call out until the very last minute although written requests had to be in by midnight on April the 1st as specified by the court. I also asked how many superintend uh, excuse me how many substitutes she plans on bringing in today to cover. She says that number is still up in the air though she would be happy to get that to us later. Again, this has been the last few days of a swirling controversy. Uh, teachers uh, having to file suit uh, to secure their day off and say that they are entitled to it. A court agreed with that. But again, the chairs will be filled in most places today with the exception of Western Hills Middle School. And Superintendent Judy Lenston herself actually plans on teaching class on filling it at Hope Highland School uh, I like this comment, so I want to convey it to all of you. She said she'll have to take off her administrator heels and put on some more functional footwear today as she gets back into the classroom. She taught for some two decades before getting into the administrative end of things, and she'll be making that return today. So again, school, as we head on, uh, as this week closes, the work week closes, we have Good Friday today, Easter on Sunday, of course, uh, a time of great importance for many families uh, of faith. And we will continue to follow this story. Hopefully talk to the superintendent. She'll be available later on today. And also perhaps get some parents' take on what has been a long time coming in all of this. But there's your definitive answer. Live in Cranston with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom. I'm Jared Planner, Eyewitness News.